Access to quality and affordable education remains one of the key pillars of Kenya's Vision 2030 and coming at a time when the country is seeking to fast track the sustainable development goals through increased public-private partnerships, the proposed bill by Kiminini Member of Parliament Chris Wamalwa will go a long way in ensuring access to quality education. Speaking in Nakuru, the legislator noted that public schools often contend with high number of learners and limited resources. When it comes to national government, uh, their function of course uh, primary schools, secondary schools, they can also go into partnership with the private sector, whoever wants to invest in it so that they can be able to tap that particular segment or that particular session which has been tapped, maybe because of the shortage of resources that uh, maybe we could not be able to, to have gone through. He said the bill seeks to bridge budget shortfalls by bringing in private investors. Wamala said the bill, if adopted, will see the private sector engaged in curriculum review. Bridge Academy's regional director, Estangu, recommended the move, saying deliberate and mutual partnerships in education development will help a considerable number of vulnerable children from underprivileged households access quality education. The issue that have really, we are really trying to look into, how do we really work closely with everyone, even with the government, and it's a good thing like that we have heard today from the Honorable Chris Omaro that they're working on a legislative, that there can be the government uh, private partnership. That is something really will be key to making sure that even we are reaching to more people in this, uh, in this community. They were speaking at an education forum that brought together more than 500 directors of Bridge International Academies drawn from 44 counties. Mary Mwoki for Channel 1 News Hour.